Does him showing up change the way you see things? Um, for me, no. But for those that didn't believe it should, right? But for me, this is all part of the game. Yeah, This is the business. This is the stuff that people don't like to get into. And people get mad or upset or hurt when certain people handle businesses their own way. People handle businesses own way. Now, if you listen to what Kyle said, and I think we've been saying this for the longest, John. <laughs> what was that thing I said? Kyle Shanahan's going to have to do what he did with Trent Williams in the 25th hour and have that conversation and like, look, dog, stop kidding around. I know this is what you want. I'll make it happen. Get your butt on the plane, be on this team, and let's go. And yeah. that's what – why do you think d even here? People thinking it's because of the 90 grand. I don't really think it's because of the 90 grand. I think it's because of his relationship with Kyle Shanahan. I really Ooh. do. I, we got, I got a clip pulled up right here. You, you've talked about Kyle Shanahan and Debo's relationship. Let's hear from Kyle himself today. Um, I mean, they always talk. I mean, I'm not going to get into that. And you guys can ask Debo to speak for himself on that. But, um, I mean, love our relationship with Debo. And um, hopefully that will help us be able to solve this contractually uh, before we get to the season. Love our relationship with Debo. I, it should, you, know, you know what, John? You know, being a teacher – being an educator, you build relationships, right? What are, the, what are the best managed classrooms in the world? The ones yeah. where the teachers have the relationships with the students, right? Kyle Shanahan, everybody out here preaches about the 49ers culture, right? Oh, we can't have this guy. He, he doesn't go well with the 49ers culture. Like they built yep. this kind of culture. Well, the culture was built by the head, Kyle Shanahan. Right. So Kyle knows better than anybody else, each and every player. It's his job to get to know every player individually. They might have Kyle Shanahan has to do something that John and I have to pay attention to when we get students. They're called IEPs. <laughs> yeah. You're not wrong, man. Or 504s, whichever one you want to call it. That's what they're called. He has to get an individual education plan for each player. Why? Because every player or each player is unique. Debo's unique to Kyle Shanahan, so he knows how to deal with them. So is Trent Williams. So is George Kittle. They all have uniqueness, right? That's what we love about these players. It doesn't make me feel any different, but I am happy that Debo is showing that sign of maturity and that he decided to show up to to be a part, you know, a participant in minicamp, he's not going to practice, but he's there, and that should yeah. be all that matters. And you know, you talk about that relationship. This is the same relationship in the Cowboys game, which we were at, where D, we get the interception, and mm -hmm. Debo just walks up to the head coach and says, "Give me Give the me damn the ball. ball. Give me <laughs> the ball." That. That's what he said. He said, "Like what you said." And and Kyle goes, "Okay," and gave him the ball to score a touchdown. Like, <laughs> okay, that's, that's the, the relationship. relationship. That's the relationship. That's the relationship. Now, why didn't Debo go, go into the to NFC Championship and say, Kyle, give me the damn ball? I don't know. I don't know. But maybe. My theory well, is. Well, they did. He was returning kicks. He was doing everything. No, but it was like he he saw one look. You, you can't tell me that there were 11 people on Debo Samuel, John. Come on, man. Yeah. Maybe, no, maybe he, I went back. No, we went back on Patreon and – Debo and Ayuk were wide freaking open. The whole don't, 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 don't you game. tell me that. No, I, I'm, I'm trying not to. I have a bunch of stuff <laughs> built up about this because people kept telling me he was on lock. What's good, Peachy? No. What's good, Brandy? What's good, Kylie? They said we, got, a, we got some great people in the chat right now. Mariah's right? here. Me and Mariah. This is awesome. I, we got they, some great people here. But, but they said he was on lock, John, and I no. couldn't figure out if they watched the same game I watched. But maybe they didn't have the all 22. Maybe that's what it is. Yeah. And, and they got to join your Patreon in order to see it. Uh, <laughs> there you go. I, I will say this, though. Like, pressure was unreal, right? That was the six-man front that we saw almost all game, that bare front. And, yeah, there was pressure. But, man, Debo, everybody was like, I used open. And I used was open. But I went back and watched Debo every single passing play. And, yeah, it was unreal, man. 